I wanted to have a, a competition that actually taught the students something and gave them hands-on experience and certainly fabricating steel and designing steel and building steel and overcoming design criteria and challenges was was a perfect fit. The important features are is what they actually do. So that planning, conceptual design, detailed design, picking materials, fabrication, building it, maybe having to go back and redesign something that didn't work the way they hoped. And, you know, that, that's the process that's really valuable. For the past 25 years, universities across the country and sometimes the world have competed in the National Student Steel Bridge Competition, spending nine months and up to 40 hours a week preparing for timed construction, load testing, and weighing. In 1992, the winning bridge weighed nearly half a ton, about a thousand pounds. Last year's winning bridge, 85 pounds. Wow. We've really got a lot more sophisticated in the development of the bridges. The students have clearly learned from the experiences. We have a lot less failures now than we've had before. We have students following the, the rules more carefully than they have before. And I think what we also are seeing is we're seeing the different methods of construction coming into the bridges that hadn't come in the past. After graduation, they will be part of a team that develops a project from beginning to end. NSSBC gives the students the opportunity to employ their skills in a real-life, scalable situation while preparing them for their future. The NSSBC provides the biggest platform for, for students to come together and um, not, work, not only work with each other, but also with industry, pro industry professionals and with industry leaders. This competition has set me on a pace to where I'm at right now in my career. If it hadn't been for this competition, I most likely would have dropped out of school because of burnout. While every student's NSSBC experience is different, they all leave the competition with the same feeling. They developed something they could be proud of. 